What's up everyone, this is Cybernide, and today I'm going to open up a uh, brand new Yu-Gi-Oh! Chaos Box. So yeah, this is, I believe, the newest Chaos Box that's just been released, and yeah, I mean, this time we have Dark Paladin on it, I guess that's how you can tell uh, the difference on it, and uh, also you still get four booster packs, four duelist packs, but also another one of the changes is that you get a mystery pack as well, and it's not like, uh, I think last time it was a figure hanger or something like one of those Yu-Gi-Oh keychains, so we actually get an extra pack on this, so that is awesome, and of course too, I found this at Walmart, I think they're only at Walmart, and I guess you also have uh, a chance for a legacy pack as well, I guess it's like 50% chance, one out of two, so uh, yeah, hopefully we have some good luck, and uh, let's see what's in this box, because honestly, Chaos Boxes have been a lot better than even like the Mystery Power Boxes. Seems like you get more packs for your money, and uh, we just hope we have good luck. <laughs> I mean, plain and simple. So be sure to hit that like button and uh, share your energy with me, and we'll see if we can uh, get some cool cards from this. I don't know. Oh, we have a mystery pack. Okay, I guess I guess that's one of the ones you can get that we have 50% chance of getting. So I guess that's a good start. I'm not really sure, but we'll see what else. Can't tell, or maybe that's just the uh, mystery pack. Then, after that, we have Spirit Warriors. Not too bad. Then, uh, Invasion Vengeance. Hadn't seen that one in a while. Uh, two, uh, Pendulum Evolution. And then, uh, a bunch of uh, Duelist Pack Kaiba, which is probably the better Duelist Pack to get these days, because we can get Ultimate Rares, obviously. And I believe that's everything, right? Yeah. So, uh, Bulls go Pendulum Evolution. Whatever. <laughs> Whatever order, really. Let's see what we can get from these. Of course, everything's holographic, by the way, in Pendulum Evolution. So Zephyr, a Divine Strike. Metal Foes, uh, Crimsonite. Then uh, Summoner's Art. That's pretty good, actually. Then, of course, uh, we have Time Star Magician. And then also we have Star Pendulum Graph. So yeah, you're always guaranteed to get two Ultra Rares and everything's holographic. It's a pretty cool set, but uh, yeah, I mean, <laughs> it all depends on how Pendulum Magicians are doing, really. So, because that's pretty much the whole set is obviously Pendulums. There are some sought after cards though lately that's in the set. We ever get like Astrograph back and then uh, Iris Magician, then yeah, Pinchum Magicians could come back really easily. Got one of these Zephras. Let's see, another Metal Foes. A uh, Skull Crobat Joker. That's pretty good actually. Then a Time Pendulum Graph. Another one that's good, but I think it got reprinted recently. And then we have uh, White Wing Magician. So yeah, the, I guess, Crystal Wing, uh, you know, it's, it's Magician form. So, or Clear Wing, I guess, technically. So uh, yeah, that's pretty cool. We got one of the Magicians then. Again, you know you're getting hollows from that one, so. That pack will get better if, like I said, Magicians start doing better. Oh, okay, I guess I had them upside down. Well, let's see, we're guaranteed a hollow in this one too, if it will focus. There we go, okay. <laughs> Make sure you guys can actually see the cards. And, okay, this pack's just weird. First off, for a rare, we have uh, Super Heavy Samurai Soul Peacemaker, and then, ah, uh, a uh, Super Rare. I was hoping maybe be a high rarity card since the pack was kind of weird on that. But yeah, it's Spiral Master Plan. A decent card. Oh, we got one of the Paleozoics. I think that one's the one that people are really going after these days. You can get it as a hollow from an Astro Pack or OTS Pack. Maybe OTS, I'm not sure. Now, of course, uh, Spirit Warriors, which... Everything's holographic out of this one, too. It's kind of like a hidden arsenal or whatever. So first off, we have Magical Musketeer Doc. Let's see, some of the Weather Painters. Then, uh, we have uh, Secret Six Samurai Fuma. Not bad. I mean, yeah, basically all the Six Samurai are good to get. And, of course, Magical Musketeers. So this set is actually pretty good. And these days, uh, I think it's going to get a little bit tougher to find. And uh, I think people are going to want to get those Six Samurais. Especially if we ever get that Link Monster. Hopefully sooner than later. And you know what? Let's go on ahead and go with the duels packs, and then we'll end with a mystery pack. Build some kind of suspense. I don't know. Maybe it has a good legacy pack in it. No idea. Familiar Knight? Oh, did we really? We got an ultimate rare! Holy crap! We actually did it! And Pot of Greed this time! Oh, man! I, I thought I could tell on the edge. I, I can't believe that. That might be, like, the one Ultimate Rare I haven't gotten from this set either, because uh, you guys have noticed I've got, like, Crush Card Virus, I think, a couple of times. I can't believe I actually got Pot of Greed. Oh, man, that is awesome! 
<laughs> wow! I, I thought it was something, because I could see the holographic on that edge. I, I can't believe that. And, uh, yeah, it's that card, too. Nobody knows what it does, even. So, now it looks like we know. Draw two cards. And also have an ultimate rare. I've never had an ultimate rare version of this card. I've always wanted one from this set. So, that is awesome. If I ever get to use this card again, you know, I'll be ready. I have the ultimate rare. So, <laughs> I don't think we'll ever get Pot of Greed, really. But, that would be cool. Either way, that is so cool looking. <laughs> like I said, I have never gotten this card from this set. And then also we have different Dimension Dragon. Wow, though, that is, that's insane. Uh, I have some sleeves somewhere <laughs> next to me. I knocked a few off my table right there. <laughs> I'm too excited. Uh, but yeah, we actually got like probably one of, the, at least one of the best cards. I was going to say best. It's at least one of the best cards of it. So yeah, we have to get a sleeve for that. That is awesome. Okay. <laughs> I like this mystery box now. I'm glad I picked this up. It's a good chaos box. All right. What else you got for us, Kaiba? Dang. <laughs> Let's see. ZML Tank, X Head Cannon. Kind of cool to get those. Then Vorse Raider. An old favorite of mine. Wow. I, I can't believe that. That's why I said I, I like getting the Dual Pack Kaiba because you have just chances to get Ultimate Rares in. You guys know I love my Ultimate Rares. I want them back in main sets. Ancient Lamp. And then Pet in the Dark Clown. Kind of wish this was hollow. That would be cool. And last pack uh, besides our mystery pack. So, let's see what we can end with. And with something cool. Familiar Knight. I think he was giving us good luck last time. Polymerization. Then. Ah, uh, unfortunately not. Uh, we have Paladin of White Dragon. But yeah, I can't complain at all. And uh, let's see what's in this mystery pack. See if it's actually a legacy pack or or what. Because I have gotten newer packs from these. Most of the time, though, we get an older one. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't know there was a card in there. I almost messed it up. Oh, man. I need to be more careful. All right. So first off, we got Metal Raiders. So we did get a legacy pack. That's awesome. But also, too, our card is uh, the Six Shinobi. So that's kind of... Uh, yeah, it's Spirit Warriors. So there you go. I'm about to say, I think that's Spirit Warriors because Six Samurai. That is awesome. And let's open up our last pack. Can we end with the hollow? Because we are not guaranteed one with Metal Raiders. Let's see. Of course, I'm going to assume this is from the Legendary Collection. I think so. Be cool if it was the original ones, right? Queen's Double, Bottom Dweller, uh, Katamari Attack. That is actually, I think, pretty good to get from this set. I don't know if it's as hyped as it was. But yeah, I do know that's one of the better fusions because Instant Fusion. Then uh, Ancient Elf. Great Moth. Hey, that's kind of <laughs> nostalgic. And, oh man, I thought we had a hollow because I saw that we had a fusion. A Guilty of D-Knight, though. I, I remember liking that card because obvious reason has knight in the name, so you guys know me. And, yeah, unfortunately, we did not end with a hollow on that, but, again, I can't say anything. First off, we got Metal Raiders pack. That's cool, but that pot of greed, that totally just made my day my week right there so yeah i hope you guys have enjoyed if you did be sure to hit that like button subscribe ring that bell so you don't miss out on future videos hope you have a great day and of course i will catch you guys later see ya